here's a quick showcase video to show all the parts that we have ordered so far. So right here is a micro SD, it's a micro SD adapter. Uh, this is a stepper driver board. This is a multiplexer for the light sensors. This is one of the light sensors. Uh, we've got all of these are soldered. This is one of the ESP32 DEF boards. This is a micro SD breakout board. Over here we have two stepper motors. I'm um, sorry, two servo motors. They're connected to this motor driver. And then here we have the large stepper motor. This is the testing of the Hello World example code given by Espressive. As you see, it's printing Hello World to the terminal on the monitor. And it's restarting every 10 seconds from the ESP. This is the testing of the example code Blink given by Espressive for the ESP32. From the monitor, it's showing turning the LED on and off. As it's doing it, it's turning the LED from the microcontroller on and off. Here's a demonstration of the file system with the SD card breakout port. So, first I'm going to plug in this SD card into my computer and show that there is nothing on it. So, I'm going to put a. Uh, I'm just going to put like a random file on it and then eject. So now I'll take it out. I'll remove the micro SD from the adapter and insert it here into the breakout board that is connected to the ESP32. So now you can see that's in there, clicks in. And then once I'm ready there, I'm going to flash the software to the board that is going to format the SD card and write a file to it. So now that that's finished, I'm going to take this out and put it back in here. Put this back into my computer. We can open up the file explorer and see that it created this new text file um, telling us that this file was written through the SD software. This is the testing for the VEML7700 light sensor. So here is the code that is being run to flash to the monitor. In this room, it's reading about 275 lux from the sensor and about 310 lux of white light. If I cover my hand, it'll register a much lower value, about 24, because it's dependent on how much light is coming into the sensor. Servo testing linking with the SD32C6 32, um, with the angle of 180 degree um, in the increment of two steps.